Their previous home game was all about rising for Alex. Now three weeks later, with their stricken teammate making encouraging progress on the long road to recovery, Newcastle's deal with Brisbane was about rising up the ladder. Talented teenager Jake Marmo rose from Holden Cup and received a warm welcome to the big league. And here's Marmo away. Oh! For a short time, and he's hit by a brick wall called Alex Glenn. The Kiwi forward made his mark on the Hunter Stadium scoreboard as well. It's coming down far back the goal line. They've knocked it back. Brisbane are going to score the first try here. They've got there, and it's Alex Glenn who puts it down. They might want to have a look at it. Let's have a look. No, they point to the spot. It's 4 0 the Broncos. Sam Thiday may have been missing from the Broncos lineup, but Matt Gillett did more than enough to make up for him. Barber, inside ball, Gillett, they won't stop him oh. there, inside the post, beautiful inside ball, he kicks it out of the park, they lead 8-0, kick to come the Broncos. After steering his runaway back rower in the right direction, Ben Barber went sniffing around for an opportunity to open his account in 2014. Oh, he's in touch, I thought. Oh, back on the inside to Reed. They might need to look at this. Back to Barber. They'll call him back. Barber goes in. But, oh, gee, I'd like them to have a look at whether he's in touch or not. Yes, they're going back. The touch judge kept his flag down and with good reason as Daniel Vito brilliantly got the ball away with his feet in the air over the sideline. Barber did the rest to snare his maiden try in Brisbane colours. The Knights' reply wasn't so flashy, but hugely important to them. Big run there, there. I think Corbin Sims may have scored a try. Newcastle almost jagged another one just before the break, with Barber preventing his old sparring partner Willie Mason from planting the steed in, nervously preserving the Broncos' 10-point surplus at the midway mark. It wasn't turning out to be Big Willie's night, with the veteran reported for making contact with Corey Parker's head. And Good Friday looked even bleaker for the locals, with just over an hour gone. Got the ball away, quick hands, oh, great ball to Copley. Copley dances, in goal, got it down, try. He got it down, that's a try. The referee will point to the spot. 20 points to six, Broncos over the Knights with a kick to come towards touch. The two competition points appeared to be in safe keeping, yet Brisbane weren't about to take any chances. Hannett on the outside for the line, he's just about good there. That's a great try by Ben Hannett. Great, great score by the big man. He puts the ball down to close out the game. The visitors were intent on ramming home their advantage by utilising all of their skills and confidence. Back it came again and they're in through Hoffman, through McCulloch. What about that for skill? Parker, McCulloch, Hoffman under the pace. The referee says try. The Broncos were convincing 32-6 to six winners, ensuring they'd avoid a third straight defeat and setting up a massive Anzac Day duel at home against South Sydney. David Rollins, NRL.com.